that ain't good. Damn. What's up everyone? This is Storytime with Jesse. So it was a regular day, got in my Jaguar XJR6 and I started driving. But something weird happened. When I had to slow down because of traffic, my car started to shake and I was like, yo bro, what the hell is going on? I looked at the dash and I noticed that the voltage was dropping. My heart raised. I was tripping. I was like, no, bro, my Jag is finna shut off right now at this busy road. I'm gonna get stranded. I knew I had to make it home. And I noticed that the voltage would jump right back to normal when I stepped on the gas. So I turned off the radio to save power and I kept tapping on the gas pedal to keep the car going. I thought, man, maybe it's the alternator. It's probably faulty now. It's not charging the battery. But then again, I'm like, I just recently replaced the alternator. It can't be that, right? I finally made it to my mom's place. Oh yeah, by the way, you guys, I just moved out. I got my own spot. Your boy is growing up. That's right, so whenever you have a chance, come through and visit, you guys. All right, so back to the story. When I opened the car trunk, I found the problem. The car battery was about four years old, and the positive terminal was worn. Also, I did this very cheap modification to the positive terminal cable when I installed the Optima battery. I had to replace it, but I just never got around to do it. So, I got a new battery, cleaned the battery terminals, replaced the positive cable, and I tightened everything. And then the moment of truth arrived. I turned the key and bro, I was so relieved and happy when I heard the Jaguar roaring back to life with no hesitation. I turned the AC and the stereo on to check to see if the voltage would drop and it didn't. So we all good here, baby. The drive back home was smooth and the Jag was running perfectly. I learned that sometimes when things go wrong, it's important to stay calm and not panic. Instead, try to think of a solution Sometimes what seems like a big problem can actually be a small one and with a little effort and the right parts, you can make everything right. I was so relieved that my Jag was okay and that it's back on the road. I wanted to share this quick story with you guys because it might help someone that's going through the same problem. Thanks for listening and have a wonderful day. Late.